Hi, I'm Jaden. I am 22 years old and I am a content creator in the Midwest. Hey, Jaden, thank you for joining us at Gnomish, uh, Create with Gnomish. Um, and, you know, Gnomish is a platform that is built for creators, helping you guys monetize your platform and your content. So, you know, we, we have so many new creators who are always starting out and, you know, they have a lot of different questions. For someone who's well established, obviously you have more than 200,000 followers across your different platforms, five years of experience in the industry. Um, so first of all, tell us a little bit about what inspired you to become a content creator. Yeah, so ever since I was a kid, I have always just made goofy videos around the house and my family always made the joke that I should like be in Hollywood and be like a cin cinemographer or like whatever, you know, the people that make um, the movies and stuff. Yeah. And once uh, TikTok came out, it was Musical.ly back then. Um, once that came out, I created an account and I was like, this is exactly what I have been wanting to do forever is just create goofy content um so i did that in my very first video i created a goofy video and it got 5.4 million views of course wow and um that wasn't even really the content i wanted to create like that was just a fun i'm in high school haha ha, let's make a video um so i've kind of pivoted more towards beauty fashion stuff like that but i think it just inspires me seeing how many people like to watch my content and I think knowing that I have that many people watching just inspires me to keep going and creating more. Yeah, that's awesome. Obviously, uh, there's a lot of people who want to see all your different videos. So that must feel great. <laughs> um, so tell us a little bit about something that no one may know about you. Well, I guess I can use, I'm going to use my nurse thing. I know you know about it, but I don't think a lot of people do. Um, so I am a mental health nurse and I work in an opioid treatment program. So what we do is we pretty much, people who are struggling with addiction come into my clinic and we kind of help them through the steps of sobriety. Um, so that's great. I am, I have a long line of addiction that runs in my family. So I think by getting to do that, um, it's really nice to see addicts be able to go home to their kids and their wives and all this. And it's just really good to see that progress because battling your mind is like one of the hardest battles you can do. So seeing people overcome that and overcome their demons is amazing to me. And I love what I do. That's awesome. And, you know, obviously you're making a big difference in everyone's lives, all the people, and you're touching them in such a positive way. Um, I think obviously you, one thing that we've definitely learned over the last two, three years, especially is like how important mental health can be in everyone's lives. Right. So the work you're doing is really, really good. Right. Um, and thank you so much. Uh, <laughs> so last question and something you would tell yourself if you were just getting into content creation? I would tell myself to stop overthinking so much. Um, the audience is going to like what the audience likes, no matter how much time you put into it, no matter how much effort you put into it. You can spend five hours on a video and get 200 views, and you can spend five minutes and get 200,000. So I think just sticking with the content that you want to create, it's so easy when you start monetizing your social medias, you start having brands reach out to you. And I mean, money talks. You hear money and you're like, yeah, I'll sponsor your product. But really, it's not a product you want to sponsor. So I think just sticking to your guns and making sure that you are doing what you want. And that is going to be the best outcome. I mean, money's great. Working with brands is so fun. But making sure that you don't get burnt out on what you are doing, making sure you can still have fun making content. I think that is so important. And if I could tell myself that out of all the brand deals that I've done, I wish I would have because really sticking sticking to your gut and making the content you want to make is what is going to produce the best views, engagement, everything. So I think that's really important. And I think that's where a lot of people lose focus at is just getting so tied up in the monetization of it. We forget why we really even started, which was just a passion. Absolutely. That's so important. Yeah. And I, I think obviously the audience can tell that. Right. One when you're being authentic versus when you're not being authentic and audiences, especially on things like TikTok, really reward authenticity over, you know, hey, I'm, you know, just endorsing fit tea or not to pick on fit tea. <laughs> um, awesome. Thank you so much. Cool. That's all the questions for us. Uh, and, you know, thank you for joining us. And, you know, we look forward to all of your next content and all the great uh, get ready with me videos and outfit of the days. Yep. And I will create, I'll continue creating them because it's what I love to do. So, and I love working with Nomish. It's been amazing working with you guys.
and we love working with you. Uh, awesome. Thank you so much, Shaden. Have yes, a good day. Yes, thank you. Have a good one. Bye. Bye.